Hey there! Welcome to 7DBIM, where we simplify building information modeling for architects, engineers, and construction pros. In today's video, we're going to break down 7 key BIM terms you must know, EIR, LOD, PIM, AIM, PLQ, BEP, and CDE. Let's start with EIR, Employer's Information Requirements. This is a document prepared by the client that clearly says what BIM outputs they want, when they need them, and how they should be delivered, it sets the rules before the project even begins. Next, we have LOD, Level of Development, this tells us how detailed the BIM model is at any stage, from basic massing at LOD 100, all the way to real-world, as-built detail at LOD 500. PIM stands for Project Information Model, it's the model you use during design and construction, it contains geometry, data, schedules, even cost and time information. After the building is completed, we move to the AIM, Asset Information Model, this model supports facilities management. It includes serial numbers, manuals, maintenance schedules, and more. PLQ stands for Plain Language Questions. These are simple questions the client asks, like, what's the building's energy use, or how often does this pump need maintenance? BEP, a BIM execution plan is a game plan for how BIM will be done. It covers software, roles, file naming, model sharing, you name it. There's a pre-contract BEP and a post-contract BEP. Last but not least, CD, Common Data Environment. This is a shared digital workspace like BIM 360 where everyone accesses the latest files and models safely and efficiently. There you have it, seven essential BIM terms that form the foundation of every digital construction project. Want to dive deeper into BIM workflows and tools? Subscribe to 7DBIM and hit the bell icon for more practical BIM content every week.